This place won't exist, and probably doesn't exist by the time you see this video. Those trees are currently being cut down because this area is being slated for demolition. This is Camp Snoopy, which was the res halls for 6th college and 5th college before they got their um, actual colleges built. Um, and so since they're tearing, they're tearing Camp Snoopy down because they're going to build some like 22-story tower here uh, to house transfer and upper division students called Pepper Canyon West Living and Learning Neighborhood or something. And you can see that there's still remnants of 6th College here. Um, but 6th College has moved away from here and now this is currently just used for Ravel Overflow, I think, and transfer housing. Um, the dining hall for this place used to be food works, but due to construction for the Epstein Amphitheater and the trolley station, um, you can't... Food works is like across the construction, so you have to walk all the way around through like Price Center, um, or you can walk towards Gilman and go to food works. And so instead, they have like a vending machine that sells cup noodles as their dining hall. And I don't think you, have to, you don't have to get a dining plan to live here. Uh, so since they're tearing this place down, I'm just recording this to show uh, what Camp Snoopy was like as like, I don't know, a record. Because it might be cool to see buildings before they were torn down. I don't know. So I think back in the day, before they built ERC in like 19, I don't know, like the past century, um, ERC used to be here. I don't think they named them yet. I'm not sure. So it's just fifth college. And um, each building here was given its own name, like uh, Africa Hall, Asia Hall. And they kept that when they built ERC. That's why you can find halls named after um, uh, Af Asia Hall and stuff, North America Hall, Latin America Hall. So each of these Camp Snoopy buildings were named after continents. Camp Snoopy also housed uh, Sixth College. Oh, it's Guy Yang. Um, from like 2001 when Sixth College was founded to um, 2019 when they finished the North Torrey Pines Living Learning Neighborhood and started housing Sixth College in the new place where they are now. Yeah, so I guess I'll go here. This is not a dorm building. The rest of these are. I don't know how many people live in each suite. I had to ask, I don't know, my RA, because she lived in Camp Snoopy. But here is a, the common building. There are mailboxes. Um, that pink thing is probably for like recycled water. Uh, this looks like the clubhouse. Um, no, the clubhouse is there. This is probably for, I don't know, ICRA and NRHH, I think, are the residential um, orgs for Pepper Canyon. And, yeah. There is a laundry room here. There's also an Amazon locker here. Snoopy. Very cool. There must be very dirty or something. Very sus. At least they have a water bottle refill station. Um, so this is the clubhouse. Is there anyone in here? I don't know. There, yeah, since they're tearing down Camp Snoopy, that includes... Uh, the village clubhouse. Yeah, Camp Snoopy is now the village for transfer students, so 
it's the village clubhouse now. And the clubhouse is where they usually host events um, or something, like for org meetings and stuff. But um, they're tearing this down. And so I saw them painting a side room in the lodge at Pepper Canyon East, all the way over there. And apparently those orgs that we just saw over there are moving to the lodge and ditching the clubhouse. I think the clubhouse exists in New Six as well. No, New Six has the lodge and the doghouse, not the clubhouse. Actually, maybe this used to be the doghouse. I don't know. Because uh, when they built New Six, they just copied everything from Camp Snoopy over. Here's the vending machine. That's like HDH is substitute for food. You can see that they have cup noodles. I kind of, I don't know. I think that's funny. I don't know what this is. Let's see. I guess one of the nice things about living in Six is that you're right next to a parking garage. But I guess, sorry, old Six? I'm, I'm, but new Six is on top of a parking garage as well. So, no change there. I don't know. They call this Camp Snoopy because, you know, it looks like a summer camp. It used to look a lot nicer before they balded all the trees. Um, I don't know. I wasn't here back when 6th was here. I'm just like a little lost tourist that googled things on Wikipedia. I, I, I'm assuming that most of the rooms here are triples. Actually, we could probably count. If there's like a door with stickers on them, you can probably count how many people there are in the suite. I'm assuming each door is like a suite. Um, and each building or each set of buildings has an RA, and the RA lives with a suite, I'm assuming. So the letters on these boards here, they can be lit. You can see that this one's torn down. Someone stole it. Uh, devious licks and so there's a light behind it and you can see there that there's like I don't know there's like a bluish tint or something to it so it's like not paint it's like translucent for light um, so all the buildings here are numbered after like seven I guess seven oh something very cool Looks like a camp, a summer camp. That's why it's called Camp Snoopy. I'm assuming it's called Snoopy because like in Charlie Brown, the dog lives in that like house with the sloped roofs. Oh, wait. Walk behind. So the trolley station has like a second exit on the other side. It's currently closed. Let's see. Yeah, that has the second exit, like the long stairs down. And that goes all the way here, but they blocked it off. I don't know why. And the residential dean um, of Camp Snoopy lives back here. And... Um, I think for 6th, that used to be Anthony Jacobson or something, but now he lives in U6. Nice upgrade. Yeah, they live on campus. And apparently, back when he lived here, he would come out every morning and pass by the windows on this building. And they would have to close the curtains over their windows so that he wouldn't peek in or something. I don't know. I think you can hear the trolley coming. Very cool. I would 
said I'll take responsibility That's for so it. That's so fucking sick. I'll just tell him I won't drink. I've never seen you drunk. <laughs> You've never seen me drunk? Um, I don't think the new thing they're building here, Harper Canyon West, will have parking, which is sad. So Sixth College would also extend out there, and now it's still just the village. Uh, those are the Matthews and the Matthews and the Pepper Canyon apartments. Um, I think they used to house second years and a few first years back when Sixth College was here. I think now it's just transfer students, and they're still being kept around. Food works is somewhere over there. So before COVID, they think they plan to finish um, upper division housing by tw fall 2024. I don't know if COVID changes those plans because it's spring quarter 2022 right now and they've just started demolishing the trees. So they have like less than two years to, or I guess a bit more than two years to finish uh, building upper division housing here. I think there probably were a lot of events hosted on the grass. Um, So I believe that the current plans um, for this area is that um, the trolley station over there, that's done. The design and innovation building over there, that's done. Then they're going to build the Epstein Family Amphitheater over there, which you can see the frame for over there. And then they're going to build uh, the Stewart Art Collection walkway from the trolley station to uh, the road by the visual arts area. And then so that's going to be done probably, I don't know, summer 20 next year maybe? I don't know. So then this side over here will have Pepper Canyon West, the um, upper division and transfer housing towers. And it will be like right next to the Epstein Amphitheater. <laughs> 